Yeah, 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 Dose. Dose. yeah, Started from the mud, now you see it's going up. Numbers never lie, now you see it's blowing up. People use the front, now you see them showing up. So what's up? I've been down and now but look, keep it a buck. I don't Hey everybody, it's Purple Haze. I'm back with another reading for you guys. A special requested video. Okay, I'm going to be doing a celebrity tarot reading. Yay! <laughs> um and I was requested to do Beyonce. Um, so that's what I'm going to do. Okay. So what's going on with Beyonce. So she's been quiet. So that'll be interesting uh, for me. To see what's going on with Queen B. Okay. Alright. Um, thank you God. Thank you universe. And thank you ancestors for all that you do. And all that you will do. For every lesson is a blessing. Please continue to shine your positive light on me. As well as the person that I'm doing this reading for. Which is Beyonce, the infamous Beyonce. All right, let's see what's going on currently with Beyonce. What is um, her vibe? What's going on with her? What's on her mind? Have you on her conscience? All of this good stuff. And we're going to also touch on um, her energy. Okay, let's go. What's going on with Beyonce? <laughs> We have the High Priestess. Okay. God damn, girl. We got the Three of Wands. Hmm. The Five of Wands in reverse. Okay. Give me two more. The Moon card in reverse. And one more. Beyonce, what's going on with her? What's going on with her currently? Okay, let's try this again. Give me one more card for Beyonce. What's going? On, what's going on with her currently? What is the vibe? Um, all right, okay, Beyonce, y'all want to tell us what's good? Let me check it one more time, and we're just gonna put it on the top. Okay. Three of Cups in reverse. Hold on, I'm trying to fit it in, but whatever. Okay, now we're going to pull one card here for her overall energy. What's going on with her? What's her energy like right now, currently? Okay, what is Beyonce's energy like? Oops, do that again. What is Beyonce's energy like? Okay, give me one card which pertains to what is her energy like. Almost, it out. What is her energy? Ooh. Mm, of course. <laughs> Woman holding the coin. Always about her coin. Okay, let's go ahead and get started. So this is going to be pretty interesting because the vibe that I'm getting from these cards here, like Beyonce is giving me like, very much rebel she's not or she doesn't want to put on this image where everybody thinks she is like she's going against what everybody thinks that she is let's get started with the highest priestess card here um she okay she was used to doing things the exact same way for a very long time it's like she she loves what she does and she loves what she she's doing but at the same time she wants to find a different way of doing it she wants to find a different aspect of doing it it's like she wants to be in control of it even more um if it's not gonna go in a different way like she's tired of the same old same old if it's not gonna go in a different way or a different direction or if she can't if she's not inspired to do it differently then she's not gonna want to do it she's tired of the same old same old she doesn't want to do the same thing over and over again like she's struggling to, to find something different in some kind of way like she's tired of the same old shit and then with the three of wands here it's like she already came up with a decision it's like she came up with the decision and now she's waiting on the results but nobody there's not so many people who knows what this decision is it's like she got her hands under the radar it's a lot of things that she's doing underhandedly um 
behind people's back, so to speak, but she's doing it for her. So it's a lot of things that she's doing that a lot of people aren't even aware of, not even the people that's closest to her. And then with the um, five of wands here in reverse, it's like, she's, that's why I'm saying she's being very rebellious. She's not doing things the same at all. She's not even following the rules, so to speak. Like, she's breaking the rules. She's doing it in a way that she wants to do it. She's 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 not doing the quote-unquote right thing to do or the right way to do it. No, not the right way. She's not doing things the political way. It's like she's rebelling in all aspects. She don't want to be this good girl. <laughs> I don't know that's what I'm getting, but why well, I'm getting that, but... It's like she's tired. She didn't want to be this good girl. She didn't want to be underestimated just because she's been put on this pedestal. It's like, yeah, I've been put on this pedestal and I'm up here, but don't get it twisted. I still got something up my sleeve that you have absolutely nothing, no type of knowledge about. Oh, girl. And then with the moon card here in reverse, yeah, it's like she she's looking at people differently around her. People are not who they seem they are. She might be getting a new team, a completely different team, because she feels like the people around her is just not who they said they were. Like, they're not as loyal as they were, or, like, things are things are looking a bit hazy for her. She doesn't like the way things are looking when it comes to the people around her. That's why she's doing things underhandedly, because she don't trust a lot of people in her own circle right now. So it's somebody that she's close to that she's not trusting and she's doing some underhanded things because that's the only way she feels like she's going to have that the results otherwise people are going to try to make her do the political thing which i mean in, in my personal opinion like you beyonce you ain't gotta listen to them anyway but i guess it's all about image okay child and then with the three of swords here in reverse she i guess the decisions that she's making nobody is agreeing with her or they feel like that's not the best way to go. They're kind of doubting her in some kind of way. And she feels like she's alone in this. She don't feel like her opinions and her values and her her um, um, her um input is being taken seriously. She feels unappreciated. And she's not here for it. <laughs> um, And then with the energy card here, overall, she's about her coin. And she's about making sure things are good. Not just about her coin. She's about keeping her... Her image up. She is about that. And she's about valuing herself. And she's going to continue to do that. And that's probably why she's feeling the way she's feeling about these people. Because she she sees the value within herself. And they're trying to play her. It's like, I'm, be, I'm Beyonce and at the end of the day. So, you can't get nothing past me. That's how she feels. But she feels like she can get a lot of things past them. So... Basically, she has a lot of a lot of things up her sleeve that is. We're probably going to see a completely different side of her. It's not going to be this goody goody girl um, at all. Probably why she's been so quiet. It probably has nothing to do with music. It's something different. Like I said, she wants to be inspired to do something different. She wants to use her talent as far as music. She still wants to do that, but in something totally different. Like that nobody's going to ins inspect expect for her and she already made the decision already i told y'all it's done the, si the decision is already made which means that we're gonna find out exactly what it is that she's been doing behind closed doors that she's been keeping under wraps and you know beyonce is good at just throwing some shit out there but yeah that's what i have for beyonce she's basically like <sighs> she feels like she has to do it all herself she feels like nobody understands or nobody thinks the way that she does so the best way for her to get it done the right way is if she does it her way even if it means breaking the rules even if it means doing some underhanded shit and even if it means getting a whole new team that's exactly what she's gonna do like she don't she doesn't want to be the good girl no more that's dead <laughs> so that's what i got for um beyonce celebrity reading you guys um I hope you guys enjoyed it. That was pretty interesting. Um, and, my, and these readings are going to be pretty short. You guys know I don't really like to, to to tap into anybody's personal life too much unless they want me to. And you know, she don't know me from anywhere. So, that's what I got for her. I hope you guys enjoyed the reading. And again, if you have any more suggestions, let me know. Um, I saw that somebody had suggested, I think, uh, Cardi B. 
right? Am I missing anybody else? I did Nicki Minaj. If you haven't seen my other videos, I did Nicki Minaj. Um, I did Rihanna. And then now I'm doing me. Oh, and I did Drake. I did Drake as well. That was requested as well. And then now we have Beyonce. So if you have any more people that you would like me to tap into, let me know. Um, and I will see you guys in the next video. It's Purple Haze. Don't forget to subscribe, okay? Hit the, hit the subscribe button. Hit the like button. Share all that good stuff. And I will see you guys in the next one, okay? Bye. Check for me.